So hey, Millie Rocks, it's Camille coming to you back with another video. Today we are on Vlogmas Day number three, and we are going to do some strawberry cake cookies, okay? So I don't know if you guys have seen these. They kind of went viral on TikTok, and they actually have been around on YouTube for a little bit of time. They're very simple, easy to make. I'm just going to show you guys how I make them, and I'm going to do a live taste test to see how good or bad it tastes okay <laughs> so all you need is a glass bowl or bowl any type of bowl i'm going to use the strawberry supreme cake mix we need two eggs some vegetable oil you only need a half a cup i'm going to use some cooking spray for my cookie sheet and some strawberry icing okay so this is very very simple it's easy as one two three i'm gonna put y'all hip um i even saw someone do the half lemon and the half strawberry so you know you never know what we might create okay so if you guys are interested in this video you already know what to do stay tuned and it is time for the cake mix all right y'all so now that we have the cake mix i'm gonna go ahead and add the two eggs all right, y'all, so now that we have the eggs in, I'm going to go ahead and add the oil. And literally, the eggs and the oil has been added. Those are the only ingredients that you need for this recipe. I'm going to go ahead and get the whisking, okay? I'm gonna do 350 preheat. All right, y'all. So I'm just using a tablespoon to form my cookies. You can use whatever you want, but this is what I'm using. I spray the pan. I have my oven on 350 degrees. I'm gonna leave it in the oven for about. I might do like nine minutes because if you, I heard if you cook them too long, they can get a little crunchy, and you want them to be nice, soft, airy. And chewy so I'm gonna make sure to take mine out or wash them closely around eight minutes um, again you could probably get about 16 cookies from this recipe mine are pretty pretty darn big but yeah so we're gonna drizzle the icing on these after they cook and then I'm gonna come back and do a taste test all right guys they're looking pretty good I did take them out um, at the 10 minute mark I checked them at eight minutes. They were not done to my liking. So I did add on two more minutes and they look amazing. I am going to take them off of the cookie sheet so they can stop cooking. And I'm going to add the rest of the cookies um, to finish off. And yeah, add the icing. Looking pretty good. Have my icing. I'm just going to put it in the microwave for about 15 seconds. This is the consistency that you want. I see. Don't they look so pretty? Love these. Hey y'all, so you get to see me. I look pretty busted. That's why I was not trying to come on camera. But I'm about to taste a piece of this cookie, okay? I'm just taking a piece off. Mm. Mm. Really good. Really, really good. I, <clears throat> a little sweet we got caught in my throat. But these are really good. Really good. And mine do have a little crunch to them. As I said before. Take them out at eight minutes. Let them cool on the cookie sheet and they'll be nice and chewy. So I knew what to do the second batch. These are still chewy though. So one batch has no icing and the other batch has icing on it. So I think I like it without the icing. But I rate these a double double thumbs up it's a winner yum yum Cheese. 